welcome to my channel and welcome to today's video stretch marks striation streaks bluish greenish blackish you name it stretch marks on the body now most people tend to get stretch marks around their stomach area after giving birth people tend to get stretch mark in this area people tend to get stretch marks and their thighs their hips and basically anywhere on your body you could have stretch marks now today I have a wonderful stretch mark remedy for you this is in the form of a stretch mark cream now you're gonna use this on your skin to get rid of your stretch marks in no time this is a wonderful moisturizing remedy that is gonna plump the skin up and with continuous use of this cream is gonna slowly fade your stretch mark now if you have just minor stretch marks they're gonna be gone in no time now if you have severe stretch marks they're gonna take a little time to move but eventually with continuous use of this they're gonna be gone in no time also so if you're having stretch marks and you're looking for just the one thing that is really great that you're gonna see great improvement in little or no time then this remedy is for you now before we get in the kitchen to whip this wonderful remedy up, let's take a look at what stretch mark is and also how we get stretch marks. Stretch marks. What is stretch marks? Stretch marks are long, narrow streaks, stripes or lines that develop on the skin that often appear on the abdomen, breast, hip, buttocks and thighs. This type of scarring happens when the skin cannot resume normal form after a period of intense growth, often due to pregnancy, weight gain, weight loss, or puberty. Over 50% of women will experience stretch marks during pregnancy. Now that is out of the way, let's get in the kitchen and whip this wonderful treatment up for your stretch marks. Our first ingredient is shea butter. And here I have some natural, pure shea butter. And using shea butter and stretch mark is very effective. Shea butter helps to remove stretch mark naturally. Applying the raw shea butter can diminish the appearance and help prevent the development of stretch mark. Shea butter is rich in vitamin A, which helps to increase skin elasticity. And I'm using about a two ounces of shea butter. You can choose to double up on the ingredient in this recipe. Our second ingredient is Vaporub. And Vaporub is known to help to get rid of stretch mark. Vaporub of camphor. And when mixed with other ingredients, it helps to clear. It also helps to fade your stretch marks. Our next ingredient is castor oil, and I'm using Jamaican black castor oil. Castor oil helps to penetrate deep into the skin. It helps to build back the collagen and elastic in the skin, therefore helping to fade, to plump, to get rid of your stretch marks. Our final ingredient is rosehip oil, and rosehip oil is loaded with retinol, vitamin A, which helps to get rid of wrinkles. It will also help to get rid of your stretch marks by fading the stretch mark, by building the collagen, boosting the collagen production, and also for moisturizing and keeping the skin soft and supple. Now the first thing I'm going to do, and this is about 2 ounces of shea butter, and you want to start by melting your shea butter. If you don't have a double boiler, you can melt your shea butter in some hot water, like I'm showing here. You can also choose to put this in a bowl with the hot water and put it in your microwave, no more than about 30 seconds. So here we have our melted shea butter. And this, as I said, is about two ounce, which is about a quarter cup of melted shea butter. While our shea butter is still warm, I'm gonna reach for the Vicks Vapor Rub. And I'm gonna use one teaspoon of our Vicks Vapor Rub. Just gonna put this in. And now I'm gonna mix the vapor rub 
in the shea butter. Just blend until the shea butter. Just keep blending until your Vicks Vapor Rub has melt. You can also choose to melt the Vicks Vapor Rub in the shea butter while you have it on the double boiler. However, I like to add it when it is already almost cooled. And next, I'm gonna add the rosehip oil to this. And I'm also using one teaspoon of rosehip oil. You can choose to use a little more if you want to. Make sure to get everything in. Next, I'm gonna add the castor oil and I'm also adding one teaspoon of castor oil. If you do not have the black castor oil, not to worry, use whatever kind of castor oil you have. Now you need to work a little fast with this since once the shea butter is cooled it's gonna get a little thick. So you want to blend this. Just blend and this is what it looks like. This is our stretch mark remover cream. Now you want to pour this in a jar with a open mouth to store because what is gonna happen once this is cooled it's gonna thicken and once it is thick you need to have easy access to get it to use on your skin so store this in any glass jar or even if it's a plastic jar but make sure it have a tight cover so now that this is done I'm gonna set this aside to cool so here we have our stretch mark cream and now this is totally cool. Now to use this stretch mark cream, you wanna use it on your skin twice per day. You're gonna make sure to cleanse your skin first and then you apply this in a circular motion wherever you have your stretch mark. And let me show you. So you're just gonna take a little and as you can see, it's in a solid state. Look at that, really nice and creamy and you're gonna just rub it in your hands and then you're gonna use it to massage the skin wherever you have your stretch marks just massage it now along with massaging this on your stretch mark this is gonna help with circulation and with circulation it's gonna help to plump the skin even further and this cream is gonna penetrate deep into the stretch mark it's gonna build the collagen production and within no time your stretch marks are gonna be totally gone they're gonna fade slowly now if you have severe stretch mark bluish blackish stretch mark you're gonna notice that they fade but it's gonna take much longer for them to be completely gone so just continue to use this on your stretch marks and before you know it you will be on your way to clean bright beautiful stretch marks free skin okay So there you have it. Thank you all for watching. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Leave your comments. Those are always welcome. And if this was the first time watching, don't leave without subscribing because I have a lot more of these videos to roll out. So look below. You're going to see the word subscribe. Click on it and you will be subscribed. Also at the side, if you want to know exactly when I post a video, at the side of the word subscribe, there's a little bell. If you click on that, you will know right away as soon as I post a video. So thank you all for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.